Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Come like a cherry pony. Come like a cherry pony. Your boy done switched up on you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look. If this your very first time in this channel, boy, are you in for a treat. That's what I said, in for a treat. Check this out. If you haven't subscribed yet, or if this is your very first time in this channel, run over there and subscribe for us. And after you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell beside the word subscribe. It's right beside it. So that you'll be notified each and every time that we upload a video. Now check this out. Now that you hit that button, and now that you hit that bell, Check this out. You're a part of the family. And that's your part of There's some things that we do. And we do them every day because they help us grow. Those things are comment, comment, comment like a share ain't gone. Hey. Comment like a share ain't gone. Come on now. Comment like a share ain't. Don't forget to comment like a share. Comment like a share. Comment like a share. Don't forget to comment like a share. Comment like a share. Comment like a share. Don't forget to. Don't forget to comment like a share. Okay, you guys, check this out. We'll go ahead and pray, and we'll get into the goodness. Here we go. Amen. How y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? Look, we ain't in no live, so I ain't got to look <laughs> at all them comments. But you see him, he's here today. Bobby's here, you guys. You guys, today, before I forget, I'm not going to forget anyway, y'all. I sponsor ship, you guys. The coldest water bottle. If you like your coldest water bottle, make sure you look in the description box. It's wherever the top in blue. Get you one and put in the code L L I P S. That's me. Lips. <laughs> and they'll give you 10% off of your entire order. Check this out, you guys. Today, we've already prayed. So, today, you guys, we have food from Alibaba Mediterranean Grill. It's Arabic food. I'm going to tell you what it is in a minute. But I got a few more things to tell you right now. You guys, we got our lips hot sauce. And if you like your bottle, it's also in the description box. We're up at the top two. It's in blue. Get you one. Guess what? Y'all know he had to come to see y'all. Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is to help us out, y'all, because, baby, we ain't never had this, so we might need to range it down. <laughs> Let's see if he's got to be a Watch this. Mmm. Yes, he is. Okay, y'all. Check this out. Now, we got this our first time trying this. So, this right here, I know is pita bread. Mm -hmm. uh, this right here, these little balls right here, is this here is called falafel. It's got some little pickly stuff in there, like little pickles and let me say. Mm-hmm. Oh, a bunch of pickle stuff in there. Try it out. Okay. That's called falafel. This stuff right here in the front, this right here, this is called hummus. It's spicy too, because I already had it up in my mouth. <laughs> this back here, I, I tried to, it when I was putting it in there, I got it on my finger. Which one? Let's do this. Shit. This right here is baba kanook. Baba, baba kanoosh. Baba kanoosh. Whatever that is. Honey. I know the words, I didn't never had it. That's it right there. The pita bread. This here is, this red stuff right here, I've got some right here. It goes on the food here. It's called uh, sawa. It's called sawa. This stuff right here in the front right here, you can see it right there, it's called tahini. There's sauces. This here is for the pita bread, I know that. This right here is an Arabic salad. Take it. This here is called an Arabic salad. It's already got its own dressing. We had it propped up so you could see it. <laughs> That's an Arabic salad, okay. These here, obviously, are lamb chops. Uh, this one right here ooh, is called Chicken Kufta Kebab. Ooh, that look good. Y'all look at how that look. Chicken Kufta Kebab. That's what that is. This one right here is a lamb kebab. Kufta Kebab. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> and this right here is called Sheesh Lamb. I'm gonna taste that. Hold up. It's called sheesh lamb. 
And this one right here is called, this one right here is called chicken. Oh, what they say? I don't know, but it's called chicken popsicles. What they say? Right. Can you read that? You wrote it? No, you didn't. No, I didn't. Talk. T A W K. I don't know. That looks like T A B S to me. It's chicken. It's chicken. It's chicken. Okay. <laughs> it's chicken. It's like the lamb one, but it's, it's chicken. chicken. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, that's everything that we got up here. We've got some roasted tomatoes, roasted onions. Ooh, that look good. This right. roasted yeah. onion look good. Ooh, we got roasted peppers, and it's got some rice up under the food. Yep, we got roasted peppers. I know I'm enjoy that hot. Mm. Okay, y'all. Now we're gonna get eating. All right. All right. I'm gonna try that. It's got its own sauce here, y'all. I'm dipping. I'm dipping. Uh, just an Arabic salad. It's, it's mm. green in the middle. Get the falafel. Alibaba is at 5800 Riley LaGrange Road in Memphis, Tennessee. Okay? They were very, very nice. The restaurant was very, very, very clean. I've never had this. I'm going to see what this here tastes like. The bread? Yes, tahini. This here stuff here is called tahini. It goes on it. Look, it's stuffing. Don't, don't you touch it. It's, it's different. <laughs> it's not it's bad. very different. It's not bad. These kind of like, this is like, Cornbread. Oh, let me say. Like what that. is this? That's the uh, falafel. Falafel. It's like cornbread. That's okay. good. I know, right? That's good right there. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to say, he said this for the food. I'm going to put the falafel in here and see what it tastes like. This here is. Did I give you one over there? Oh, yeah, I got one. Oh, that right there is like. um. Pico de Gallo or something. That's what that tastes like. They have a dressing salad. Mm-hmm. It, it comes with its own dressing. Look how sour. It's kind of light. It's really light. It's fresh. Y'all Big Ben got that. <laughs> Talking him. Okay. I'm rocking the tea. Now this right here got some spice. Mm. <laughs> this one here got some yeah. spice here to it. Okay, he said this right here is supposed to go in the food. So, so I'm going to just pour it on some of the rice here. What you think? Well, I, I, go ahead. It's going to get eight. It's going okay. down. Let's see. I got some salt up here too, y'all. Y'all already know that. You already know it. Okay, I'm showing up and I say, please don't. Go okay, ahead. let's see. Let's see what this here is going to taste like with the rice. There's some of the rice. With, uh, what is this called again? Sour. Mmm. That's good. This rice is divine. <laughs> I'm gonna put it with some of this lamb chop here. No, not lamb chop. Lamb kupa kebab. Yeah. The lamb thing. Whatever. <laughs> no, it's sheesh lamb. That's what it is. It's sheesh lamb. Not whatever. We're not trying to be disrespectful, but y'all don't know what it is. It's lamb. Mmm. Ooh, it's a sour that rice is good. It's got the like, orange stuff and red stuff and yellow stuff in it. Look. It's good. It's good. You good. Try it. Oh, you got the lamb chop. Mm -hmm. This now, this style. Mmm. Well, it's different. Mmm. Well, that grilled this on. That did a very good job this time. I love this rice. <laughs> Mmm, that is good. It's good. And like I said, it's at 5800 Riley Grange Road. The restaurant is really, really clean. They were really, really nice to me. This his stuff is pickled. Oh, let me show you some now. Y'all, it come with this. I'm trying to get some of that white stuff down there. What is that? I don't know. They come on, they look like cabbage. Is it? That's yeah, cabbage. Yeah. See, come on this right here. Oh, that go real good with that pickle stuff. That's good. But that rice is the bomb, man. Y'all, this is good. Mm -hmm. 
Excuse me, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. This is real good. You want me to put some more of that uh -huh. stuff on here? I'm trying to keep it fresh like this. Before I put it on. Can you spread it out? It works. Yeah, it's good. That works. Yeah, this is good. This is my first time ever trying Arabic cuisine. This is Arabic food. It tastes really authentic too. Like, you know how you go, like, like it's not like Chinese. Like we go to a, Let me good. tell you what I saw. What? When I went in there, they got this grill. Mm -hmm. And they've got all of these big, um, like coals, square coals across this grill. Mm -hmm. And it's got a giant tower of chicken and beef and lamb. They all like stuck down on these Ske skewers and they rotating around and it's got a big grill with these, with them big bricks of fire behind it, and you're just rolling around in this grill cooking. It looked good. <laughs> it looked good. Like but now this is my favorite right the, here. The this rice. rice with this. <laughs> I'm gonna try it with the chicken. I tried it with the lamb. Mmm. Mmm. It's pretty good. It's better with that lamb, though. That's not bad either. No, it's good, but it's better with the lamb. Here, try it with the lamb. I already got lamb. Oh. Not this kind. Mm -hmm. It tastes better with that lamb. You know, it tastes better, period. Probably because we don't eat it that often. You know what I'm saying? And this lamb is good. It is. It's juicy. You guys, I would suggest this. I really, really would. Y'all, this is the business. It's good. Mm -hmm. That right there is called Baba Kanush. Now, this one right here is hot. It's spicy. This one in the front. Yeah, like cheese. Now, hummus is spicy. Mm-hmm. It's like cheese. Oh, it's got little pickled peppers in there, too. You ain't see the peppers? Mm-mm. I like everything I'm trying. <laughs> that right there needs some salt on it, though. What do? Yes. It does not. You're just, you're just addicted to Mmm. 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 It's white, it's dressed, but it's not. It's supposed to be refreshing like a, a palate cleanser. You know what I'm saying? Like after you go through the head. I guess. After you go through the head, you come back over here freshen up. Boom, 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 I like boom, this boom. here, too. Come on, turn that cornbread, though. It do kind handle, but yeah. Mmm. This, this Arabic cornbread, y'all. Hold on. We don't know that for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mean, telling you that way. But this would look like in the inside. I already showed you. I'm quick, baby. It's good. This rice, though. <laughs> this rice is a business. <laughs> huh? I'm trying to figure out what they got in it. And y'all know, I don't even eat right. rice you without know. sugar. Nope. But I can eat this without sugar. What is this good. It's really, really good, y'all. It's got a little pop of heat to it. Mm-hmm. I'm going to figure out what that is. Everything got some spice in it. For real, yeah. Mm-hmm. But you know what you eat? They're like, just a melting pot. Ain't nothing but spice. And this right here, you can see it all over there, though. I don't know what this one here tastes like. It's cheese. It's, like, it's some kind of cheese. It's like cheese, don't it? I can't really get the taste of it because of that. Mm. Hold yeah. on. Hold on. It's some cheese. Ooh, cheese. Uh, uh. You guys, this is Therapy Thursday. You're not going to get it until Friday. It's Thursday for us today. <coughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm about to get choked out. Oh. Oh, it's got olives in there. It is olive. It's olives in there. You put it on the plate. You got it. It's all pickled. I didn't look at it, though. Oh, you got carrot. Oh. <coughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You got hot on you. Ha, ha, ha. You got hot on you. Hit the back of your throat. Y'all, you know. everything in here got spice to it. I think we're supposed to do something with this bread. You're supposed to stuff them with something, but I don't know what to stuff it with. Okay, I'm going to try it with the try, lamb. Cause you all, see, look, they got pockets. No, I'm going to try with the chicken. They got pockets. Oh. Right, you're supposed to fill this up. 
I'm gonna put some chicken put in some then. <laughs> and I know we're supposed to use this with it. I know that for sure because he told me that. You mm. should look this up. Uh, it's okay. I'm trying to kebab. I know y'all think that, but <laughs> you on the right channel, baby. <laughs> you on the right channel. This here is a chicken kebab. That's a lamb kebab. Nope. Yeah. Chicken kufa kebab. He made sure I, he told me that it was kufa kebab. Okay, so here. Which one you want? I, I, I try chicken first. I'm just gonna give me some of this rice. This rice is the business. And like I said, y'all, it's a really, really nice restaurant. What's that? What chickpea? Some kind of season? I'm not eating that. It's in the rice here. I eat it. Okay, you eat it. Mm. Some kind of seasoning. Mm -hmm. It ain't supposed to be eight, though, is it? Nope. All right. <laughs> no, I ain't put it all right. Mm -hmm. And I put it in my mouth. Just for me, just for giving that flavor, though. Probably get a rice of flavor? Mm -hmm. Just for giving that rice of flavor. Well, I'm going to be looking for it if I ain't supposed to eat it. Y'all, this is really, really good. And like I said, y'all, it was a really, really nice restaurant. Uh, like in the end. Oh, hold on. Some of my face. Like in the inside of the restaurant, y'all. I can't get it out, babe. Wait. Yeah. There's always some on my lips. <laughs> really, really nice restaurant. It's really, really clean. And um, everybody has on masks, of course. And gloves and things and things and stuff. Um, okay, I'm going to taste it, too. It's good. And... Um, it's like real intimate. Like it's all boosts in there. Really low lighting kind of sort. It's real intimate. It's a really nice restaurant. Is that the one that brought a hookah? Uh, mm -hmm. right over here? I, right. Y'all. Can y'all see that? I don't know if y'all can see it. Let me see if I can show it to you better. Y'all. Mm. This right here. Like, I'm not going to tell you not to get it. Baby. That's fine. I think I said that back when I said I cannot, cannot tell you not, not to get it. I cannot, not I cannot tell you. I cannot. I cannot not, not tell you. Tell you. You couldn't get it out right. You got to get this when you get that. <laughs> now, this is good. Oh, it's really good. Oh. Yeah. Uh, what are you put up in that? Every time. Mm -mm. <laughs> I ain't going. I ain't going. <laughs> Why not? This is my first time trying Arabic food. Mine too? I want to try Jamaican too. You have your Jamaican restaurant too? Mm -hmm. We got you, you don't know what I don't know yet. The only one that I've seen is closed for Corona. Oh. Yeah, it's good. Y'all yeah, know I'm onion lover. The roasted onion. Mm. You can divide it. I am. Right. Mm hmm. Mm hmm It's good. Mm-hmm. Y'all know I love onion anyway. It's good. Mm-hmm. Y'all go there and tell them the lip sent you. Mm. It's really good. Oh, before I forget. Hey Deborah. Hey the bit daddy. Gotta make sure I throw that out there because they're gonna Mm. Try to roast me. <laughs> <laughs> Try to roast me, honey. Me too, but not saying that. I got to come in and make sure I throw it out. Hey, my diehards, love y'all. Mm -hmm. You got a lot more, but them two right there will definitely roast you. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all, here got a lamb. Mm. Mm. That one better. Oh, yeah, mm. It's good, too. But that chicken went better in this particular case. Mm -hmm. The little um the little blocks like this, the lamb is better. But in this kebab, to me, the chicken is better. You right. It's all good though. Ain't nothing bad about it. Ain't nothing on here bad. Ain't nothing on here bad at all. But believe it or not, this gives me life. That right there needs salt on it. It does not. Put salt on your head. Well, hand me my second, honey. <laughs> 
I hope people were saying that because he thought I was going to turn it down. <laughs> I am not. Then no. I need some salt. Don't do it. Mm -hmm. mm. Y'all, I am going to respect this Arabic cuisine. And I'm not going to dump no hot sauce on it. It has spice to it anyway. But I want some hot sauce, but I ain't going to do it. It's good the way it is. And believe it uh, not, don't Give me my salt. Don't think I forgot. It's a, I, I didn't. I tried to hide it from me. Nope. On half of it. That's all I put it on. If this here needs salt to it to me, y'all. It's a little um It's supposed to plain be like, for my taste. It's supposed to be like like this. It's a it's a refreshing type of chicken right? You know like, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna throw this pickle stuff over there on it. You gotta get a little zing. Not the stuff. Yeah, it's it's just a little plain for me. Mm -hmm. It's good, it's refreshing. But um, I'm used to a little more, you know, a little more booyah <laughs> in there. It just need a little more. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Uh -uh. Did you try to? Have we mind. tried everything? You ain't tried this one. Let me see. That's not the way. That's your favorite part anyway. The part closest to the bottom, huh? Mmm, mmm. Really? It's good though. Mmm, mmm. It's super seasoned. The meat. It's, it's got a good. great grill taste. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm. That, that gets them the lamb chops right. Mmm. Really? Mmm, mmm. That's good. <laughs> That's good. This rice though. <laughs> I don't one. like rice without say, say sugar. One. It's just. It's just the way they fix it. it. It's a um, I don't know what that is in it. Arabic rice. <laughs> that what it is. It's some good stuff. Oh yeah, this is good. You know when you first try stuff, you just don't know. Okay, y'all. Oh, like I said, this is every Thursday. So the commentary for the day. I said commentary. Mm -hmm. You had some white on your mouth. <laughs> I was gonna say something. Huh? The commentary for the day, you guys, is the pressures or the damage that the coronavirus, like the quarantine may have on relationships and marriages. That is yes, what we're talking about today. Mm -hmm. Who gonna go first? You pick it up. I, 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 okay. I pick it back. I'm gonna tell y'all something. We have been together 14 years, almost 14 years, we 14 years in mm -hmm. October. And we have been through a lot. There's been a lot of stages of our relationship that some went all good. Definitely, from my perspective, the good does outweigh the bad. Mm -hmm. um, we've had some rough times, though. But for me, I would say that the last since March, the last four or five months, has probably been um, the most stressful. And... Um, in some ways, tumultuous. Did I say that word right? Yeah. Yeah, it made you. You got one. You got one. It probably has been one of the biggest struggles that we've been through in all of our almost 14 years in the hands. Um, because for the last three years specifically, I'm used to him getting up early up in the morning, leaving him. And being gone from six in the morning to five in the afternoon, working. Mm -hmm. And that gives me my own me time. It gives me my own time to wind down, my own time to, you know, yell and scream or do whatever it is I want to do. Um, obviously, because of <clears throat> the Lips Hot Sauce, the merch now, the town, grocery shopping, paying bills, a lot of stuff that I do during the day, it gives me my own space. You know what I'm saying? To kind of do me. 
You don't get that through Corona. During Corona, I haven't had that because you guys know that um, he did go back to work for a little while. But y'all, I'm I'm the afraid of cat. I'm, I'm afraid of everything. He's spraying everything down. And I feel like that. Yeah. Well, this is me. I feel like that he might not have been taking Corona as seriously as he should. Um, because, I don't know, when we were together, even though I may not have to remind him of things, I do. Because it seems like he just ain't doing it fast enough for me. You know, <laughs> sanitize so you get back to the car. You know, that kind of stuff. That's so it frightened me that he wasn't taking care of business like he needed to while he was working. So he's not working. Hold up, hold Again. up, hold up, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. You said the minutes on my side. No, I, I, okay. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. That's go I'm ahead. saying that's how I felt about it. I'm not saying that that's what he was doing. Mm -hmm. That's how I felt. So he's back at home. And what the thing of it is, y'all, he get on my nerves. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know you're not talking. I don't have I that 10, 10 left, 12 hours a day by I myself. No, you're not talking. Not, uh-uh, no, no, no. Not Mr. Please watch, please this, please. I'm not making, it's not at the point. I'm not, I am the needy one. Oh, my gosh. It was like, okay, and it, it is, it, it, with the corona, it's like that times 10. Like, the stuff you normally know do, you have to amplify it. And you not only have to deal with the pressure of what's going on inside the house, you have to worry about... That nigga right there, I mean, excuse me. He is that, like, he's like right here on me. You see, he right here up on me, so you gotta deal with all this. Like, ain't nobody practicing their social distance. I got to sit back here and do this. I got to walk in the mask. I can't breathe and stuff. Got to worry about your baby. Who wouldn't want this all up on them? Who almost hit you? Stop. Yeah. <laughs> That's <laughs> all I'm saying. I almost hit you. Get on. Get, get back. I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be with him. Don't do that, sir. Right. I'm sorry, would you finish talking? You ain't got to be nice, but that's the truth. Who wouldn't want <laughs> this up on them, bro? Stop, stop. <laughs> just silly for no reason, huh? Just no reason at all. But, you know, it's, it's, it's not even just a mere... It, it just adds extra pressure. And then things from the outside sit back there and tend to fall in. Like, like, like you, you saw it. You, you started inventing problems that don't even actually exist that it wouldn't be if it wasn't corona. You know what I'm saying? Like, certain things... If we weren't quarantined. If we weren't quarantined... Now that some, yeah, I mean, this stuff. He like, always asking who called him my phone. That's all it is. All that kind of stuff when uh -huh. he would be at work and, and my doctor or mm -hmm. somebody called him about one of these orders for some of these products, vendors and stuff that's calling uh -huh. my phone. He would be asking who called him my phone because it wouldn't be him. That's all right. Who was that? Who was that right there? Okay, when was that? They just called, didn't they? <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, this is, look, this is not calling my phone too. Oh, oh that's not true. So you can have it. Oh, yeah. I had put it in my mouth. Oh, oh no, they got another piece. <laughs> but you know, and I will be here getting on this nerve. It's stressful. You need that space at that time to sit on yourself and get yourself. Sometimes it just helps. I don't know if it, it's needed. Um, it's, it is a necessity. For I don't think it's a necessity. Well, for me, it really isn't a necessity because I don't have a problem with my husband being at home getting on my nerves every day. I think that. For me, I think it's more so um, like um, I think it's the time. I don't know. I don't know how to exactly explain what I'm trying to say, but I don't think it is that I need the space from him because I love my husband. I mean, I do. Um, but it just feels like to me that the more time that we have at home together, I feel like it should be utilized to do more in-depth communication. That light is out over there. He behind the screen, so the production <laughs> work is lacking. That light out over there. I saw it when it went out. I was in front of the screen. You are gonna let me sit back and sit down and stay in my therapy Thursday, sir? Thank you. Said it. That's what I'm gonna do. To me, yeah. I feel like that the more time that we have at home since we are at home together every day now i feel like that that time should be used doing a little more you know deep communicating pillow talk uh especially the good things that come before the pillow talk the closeness the whole snuggly you know that type of thing it's like and then you know with him and his businesses and whatnot now that between this is just us personally things he was like okay you, when you got the extra space to actually do something, we filled the extra space with so much stuff so fast. You know what I'm saying? It was like that's true. A, a, an extra this, an extra that. You know, that's the baby true. Did, and we. But see, the hot sauce, the hot sauce business picked up. 
every every a guy lot picked more. up the shirts, the, the merch. We have we still have to do this. We have family and friends. We still snack time, snacks which out. if I haven't already done it, no, if you if, if, if it hasn't already so. been done by the time you get this video, uh, we're probably gonna just wait to Saturday because that's gonna be pressing me to, to get it done. Now. And we need to try to spend reach for us. Then we added uh, a live on Wednesday. I've added a lot of little lives here and there that say communicated with you. Mm -hmm. And then we have a lot of projects. Go get that right there. Oh. We have a lot of little projects that we're working on for you guys. Like I told you guys before, we have a lot of little projects that we're working on for you. And a lot of it just, it just causes a lot of time and a lot like of stress. That. I don't like that. See, like, we're working on this for you. I don't like that. This here is, I know you don't like it. This here is the lips. Uh, the little mask we're working on for you. We have, now I know that P over there look wrong, y'all. We're just starting to work on them. The I cannot is on the other side because these are just swatches of how we can do it. So we're trying to work on mask for you. The, the living life in power. Let me just get a little closer. Don't. I know it is. Y'all, yeah. this is just the first prototype that we're working <laughs> on. Uh, but we're working, we have, we have oh, a lot we, of different working, moving parts. We're working with a lot of people, and we're, you know, it's just a lot going on. We, we created that space instead of in, it, which filled in it. That, so, when you sit back and look at it, you know what I'm saying? We kind of, we kind of let Corona beat our, beat our tails when it comes down to certain situations in, in, in regards to Corona. I'm waiting. I'm, I'm listening to the, I'm just going ahead with the ASMR. <laughs> it just, yeah. I guess it happened so fast that we really didn't adjust to it as well as we needed to. I guess you look at things in hindsight, like when you look back on it, it's like, well, yeah, this could have been handled better, or that could have been done better. You know what I'm saying? I think that we could have. I you said she wasn't going to do the hot sauce. I wanted to taste my hot sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Like my but it did. It does cause being quarantined, especially when you're both at home, because I already work from home anyway. I know. Um, it's a really big adjustment. It was a big adjustment, and I think at first we just didn't handle it that well. And I'm a real. I'm the catty one. I am. I'm the catty one. Um, I'm the one that my husband is more of a. Um, I don't know how to say this. Um, I'm the one that, um, whatever situation presents itself, I want to deal with it right then. I want to talk about it. I want to communicate. I want to get this out. You hear my side. He likes to cut me off a whole lot, but you hear my side. I guess I'm long winded though too. Very. <laughs> very, very. You know, I'm the kind of one that I don't like to let things carry on. I want to talk about it. I want to get this over with. Now, he's more the type of person that, as long as we don't go to bed mad at each other, he okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, I look, okay. All right, all right, you want to say, okay, okay. Who okay. does that? I do. And I do it, <laughs> and I do it well. And I, I get the fuss in it. All he want to say is, yes, sir. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Then I turn to walk off. <laughs> that don't work for me, Major. That don't work for me. I'm fine taking that to God. <laughs> like, in, in the whole midst of the conversation, like, uh huh, all right. So. Because of that, it did cause a lot of extra stress. A lot of, um, I guess, cattiness on my part. Yeah. Resentment probably on his, I don't know. It, it, it a whole bunch of negative stuff that can come up in, in regards to them. But, uh, it ain't taking nothing to turn it around. Y'all gotta sit back and sometimes just, you know, value each other's space, value each other's time, spend a little time, take, go, like, I, like I've been doing like the last couple of days, go for a while, chill out. Take a breath. Come back. Things can get better. Things could be not so intense and not so confined. Did you try that protect the tomato, the roasted tomato? I did not. Not yet. Um, but yeah, y'all, Corona, like I said, it did cause oh extra God. stress on our relationship, especially in the beginning. Um, yeah, it did cause a whole lot of extra stress. You saw it. <laughs> A whole lot of extra. Now he needs salt. You feel me? Look, I'm putting it on one particular item. That's all I put it on. The salad, one particular item. Half is mine. See how it go. <laughs> See how it go. <laughs> he, he did the exact no. same thing that I did, mm -hmm. but he called me out for mine. No, I didn't want to tell that myself. You have to do that. But I didn't want. Well, I wouldn't eat that no way. But anywho, 
Uh, I guess we just didn't adjust to it uh, as well as we should have in the beginning because he get on my nerves. I'm like good. I said, I'm used to my own space. That's the little bitty baby corn in there too. Oh no, that's a cauliflower. I'm gonna eat it. Um. And like I said, I'm sure that there's millions and millions and millions of other couples going through the same mess. And went through the same thing. Same thing. And so that's why we wanted to talk about it. It ain't about the, the, the lack of love. And it's just, it gets intense when all you see is these four each other. And they, they just, just me and you. Because, you know, we went, and then I forgot about it. We, we, we were going through the house, the home renovation. All this good stuff. I mean, yeah, inside, back, outside, the, pain, and, the pain, the cutting down the trees. trees. All this extra stuff. And all the, you got to worry about who coming in the house, whether they're getting on, whether they're going to wear the mask or not. You what know what they saying? touching. Okay. You hear me, what you're going to touch. Then most of them were men, so do we got to be extra careful with the baby. baby. And right, we can't sit back and do this. We can't go here. And then there was another thing that always caused a controversy between because he thinks it's his, but he don't never tend to it after he planted. And that's the garden. Hold up, wait, 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 wait. You this, this year that was your garden. You didn't tell me to put stuff down and I'll watch it. And guess what I did? Now lose my garden. I would have my I would have the whole back out. But the other the other years when you said that it was your garden, I you, still the one had to pick it and take care of it all the you time. You just came and took it over. Look, I'm the one nah, who plants. Look, no, I'm the one who plants a garden, right? I see like the first time we moved here, I was like, look, I'm gonna throw me a little garden out here in this backyard. Did that went out there ten That was seven years ago now. We bought this house seven years ago. Let me seven, make sure I had seven. That. The three of those for the first two, three years, cool selling. No problem. For some apparent reason, he just got it in his head that okay. Because I was it. working then. Uh uh-huh. Okay. Well when I when I stopped working, I was here. And he took over my garden. And just we're supposed to be talking about the wrong you took over my garden, y'all. And I'm just trying to say, I mean, look, I, I mean, I had okra growing up. Oh, I had to get on ladders to pick my okra. I was, I was, I was. But he wasn't picking it. I was the one that was picking it. I couldn't reach it. Mm. Thank you very much. So I guess it took, I mean, everything, I guess, takes a team effort. But coronavirus is putting a strain on people. And I read in that, you know, divorce rates. Uh, I hate to hide. Domestic oh, violence. Right. Uh, yeah. So you, you don't understand how many times we want to just... And that's because you're closed in with that person. Even though you love them, and you really do love them. You really, really do. It is getting on your nerves. And you enjoy spending time with them, but... It is getting on your nerves. It gets to be a lot. I really, really do. It gets to be a lot. So anyway... That's the topic. Yeah, just hey, the topic with them. Y'all, but y'all, I can't... Uh, but I can't tell you this. <laughs> there are solutions to the stressors of coronavirus. Obviously, we have a child. So if we can find someone by itself, getting out of the house, outside of the house, like he wanted to go and have a family dinner. That's where you got the family uh, seafood boil at Captain mm-hmm. King's from. Because he, that's just what he wanted to do as a release, as a something outside of our home. And it was wonderful. It we really had, was. We had, what y'all saw on camera, we did an after event. But the time we just sat there as a family, and we, you know, and it was, it was just, it was. Yeah, because when y'all seen us do that video, that was actually our second time there. <laughs> the first time when we actually went to record the video. Baby, that food looks so good. We just sat down and ate. It. <laughs> so, but I we I ate the home side that day. The dressing, the, the bones, yeah, neck hog bones, hog mouth. Uh, you had lima beans. Lima I love beans. lima beans. All right, this stuff. They got a seafood board thing over there, and I sit back and came home with that. And the baby had her crab legs, so I had to sit there and pick. It was just, but we sat there. Yeah, and they sat at their table. And as a family, and just it was just it was just it was cute. It was yeah. just time for us. It was. I think we were like there for about an hour or two. It I mean, was good. I mean, but I didn't eat the we, seafood we, that day. I uh, ate the home side that day because I knew the video was gonna be more about the seafood. I ate seafood. You know, if you see seafood, I'm gonna eat it. You see, uh-huh. it's going down. <laughs> it's going down. Uh-huh. I'm gonna show y'all uh, some of the vegetables that are coming out of our garden, and then we're gonna get up out of here. But I did want to make sure that I let you guys know that there are outlets that you can do. But you need to find things outside. If you're quarantined with your mate, your husband, your wife, your girlfriend, significant other, whatever the situation may be, get out of the house if you're having problems. That's going wow. to help you. you we started thing. taking family walks. Mm-hmm. We did. We did. Grab some. Just hold the whole thing up. Grab the whole thing up. 
Y'all, this is some squash mm -hmm. that was just picked out of our garden. Aren't they pretty? These came out yesterday. Yes. Uh, we should have put down some cooked necks, but we didn't. We put down straight necks. Mm -hmm. We still got uh, uh, eggplant should be coming up soon. We got jalapeno okra, pepper. Jalapeno the cucumbers pepper. already they on the vine now. Cucumbers. It's okra. I, anyway, y'all, <laughs> everything is coming up pretty pretty well. But to let you know that that what works for us or what is starting to work for us. It or, might work for you too. Or yeah. Just, and, and, and get out the house. And if y'all got any ideas, throw it up in the comments. Please sit back and let us know something. I mean, any, every little bit help. We're, we're not perfect. We're far from it. We, we accept any advice and we'll and anything we can get to help. We're always here for you. So, so now we're finna get up out of here. <laughs> we're finna go. Mm -hmm. But that's our take on pressures that coronavirus did bring on our relationship, on our marriage. It did. It affected us. It really, really did. But it's mostly because he get on my nerves and he was wrong and I was right. Oh, no. Anyway, y'all. Anyway, y'all, we're going to get up out of here. We love you guys so, so much and we hope you guys have enjoyed Therapy Thursday. Even though on you Friday. ain't going to get it on Friday. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to see you guys next time. Don't forget, if you would like your code, it's water bottle. Look in the description box. It's in the top in blue. Get you one. Put in the code L L I P S. I'm Lips. I'm Lips. Production. <laughs> Your whole head out the video. I know. That's exactly right. Put in that L L I P S and they give you 10% okay. off of your entire order, okay? Don't forget to look in the mirror, ask yourself how you're treating yourself this week, and find out if you have brightened up somebody's day. That's so important, you guys. We love you guys so, so much, and we're going to see you guys next time, okay? Do you got anything else to say, honey? Move out the way. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys look. Always remember that there's always more than one way home. All you have to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'm going to see you guys next time. I don't forget. Big Ben says good night. <laughs> Big Ben says good night. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> now, so get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'm going to see you guys next time without him. And if you're not in to watch me next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied. Period. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Go and do your thing, honey. No, what? Bye, y'all. We love you guys so, so, so much. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, you are my sunshine. Oh, Lord. My only sunshine. She's when still you're not happy. Pick it up, hey. You just my sky. <laughs> <you know. laughs> y'all, she like, we don't make that one right <laughs> Bye, bye, y'all. See y'all next bye. time. Mm -hmm.